Everyone knows what a photo book is, so one of the first things you need to decide is what or who is your market? These definitions are relatively controversial and I welcome additional comments. A photo book is a digital or analog printed, bound book, typically including text and photos, as opposed to a photo album that consists of traditional photos. Loper's photo book is composed of her own and her father's photographs, which is the result of the artist's visits to the site of her childhood in East Berlin. However, for example, even when 200 images are automatically selected from 1,500 images and the layout of the photo book is automatically created, the user should add and delete images while checking the unused 1,300 images that have not been used in the photo book. The map is just a way to visualize places in which took place some kinds of activity around World Photo Book Day. As you can see, they are polarized between England, most of it, Iberian Peninsula and Australia. That could reflect there are more people in those places making the network of photo book clubs active. Also, the word aesthetic refers to Brecht's and Benjamin's critique of new objectivity photography, like the 1928 photo book The World is Beautiful by Albert Ranger Patch, which by turning social inequalities such as abject poverty into an object of enjoyment, through its modish and technically perfect representation, is an extreme example of what means to supply a production apparatus without changing it. Benjamin 1998, page 95, Con 2008, page 178 and Long 2008, pages 202-03. Not only do Killian's photographs purport to show real faces, his photo book is clearly part of a contemporary cultural endeavor to sharpen the gaze and access reality and is therefore rich in ideological overtones. For photo book people, the 14th of October is World Photo Book Day, WPD, and celebrations worldwide are coordinated through the Photo Book Club Group. On this day in 1843, the British Library catalogued Algae of the British Isles. Cyanotype impressions by Anna Atkins, and is therefore considered historically significant as the first official record of a published photo book. The main photo book club WPD event took place in the evening and was attended by around 24 participants, each brought along what their favorite photo book is to share and discuss with their fellow attendees. Many participants contributed their own print-on-demand books, or bespoke handmade artists' books thereby representing the spectrum of the photo and the book. The intensive two days workshop, eight hours a day on the construction and editing of a photo book is for photographers with a project to reflect and work on. We'll talk about the basic peculiarities of a photo book, working on the processes of selection, sequencing and editing, and on the aspects related to the book structure, design, materials, and final dimensions. So to put up on a notebook as a first step to develop a maquette. Initiated in November 2011 by Aperture Foundation and Paris Photo, the Paris Photo Aperture Foundation Photo Book Awards is the celebration of the photo book's contribution to the evolving narrative of photography, with prizes in two categories, first photo book and photo book of the year. An imagined term for books made by photographers has become popular over the last 10 years, follows a similar etymology as Phil puts one for artists' books and is called the photo book. Over many years the discipline of the artist's book and the newly termed photo book have occupied parallel territories. Occasional linkages and bridges have occurred and met with sympathetic acceptance, and some cross-fertilization in the discourse surrounding each discipline. Dubspout, the photo book, is everyone a publisher, PDF, 523.78 KB. Submit your photo book to Paris Photo Aperture Foundation Photo Book Awards. Deadline is the 11th of September HTTP colon slash slash aperture awards and income submit entry the first project is an individual photo book calling for the selection of photographs from the student's own archives the development of a visual structure for the book the preparation of a book dummy and the final production of the photo book which accounts for 25 percent of the marks for the unit a photo book is a book whose primary message is conveyed through the careful sequencing and editing of photographs and implies authorship by a photographer or photo editor. The term is not intended to describe a book simply containing photographs nor is it intended to denote a photographically illustrated book. While painting, photography, film may not appear like a photo book at first. The reader does not encounter a photograph until page 46. It is a detailed schematic for narrative montage. In an environment where one holds the book and turns back and forth through its pages, the reader is constantly reminded of both the materiality of the photograph, 
the photobook and the process of reception. Because written text can both limit and expand the context and space of the photograph, the use of captions in photobooks is often contentious. Currently there are many photobook software companies who sell licensed solutions to photo labs and print houses so that their customers can create photobooks and other photo-related paraphernalia with ease. These software solutions are available for free download or online access or through apps. The functional photobook, if executed with consistency and visual intelligence, has the capacity to operate on a different level from that originally envisaged. The ability to move and provoke in a way unintended by its makers that is to say, it has the capacity to display a distinctive photographic or book voice. Thus, although intention is an important criterion for the photobook, it should be recognized that, as in literature, the intentional fallacy applies in a number of cases. The growth in social networks concerned with the photobook is symptomatic of photographers taking control. There is a whole network of photobook clubs around the world. I got invited the other day to give a talk to the Bangalore photobook club. I think that is really amazing. Another change is the way photobooks have become a part of exhibitions. He cites the Dado Moriyama plus William Clean joint exhibition at Tate Modern in 2012 in which the photobook was central both to the relationship between the photographers and the way they disseminated their work. Applications are invited for a three-year full-time PhD, working within the Irish Photobook Research Project in the School of Art and Design. The project focuses the representation of Ireland through photographic publishing. He is currently a PhD candidate at James Cook University where his research question deals with the emergence of the photobook in contemporary self-publishing. The photobook is one of the most original forms of photographic expression. A collection of photographs becomes a personal concept of the world. The selection of the photographs, the dramaturgy of the image series, the design of the pages, the surface feel of the cover and many other details have to point out the idea of a book to have a lasting effect on the viewer. The objective of the photobook Mistakeless Workshop is to highlight the special qualities of the photographs, raise the participants' awareness for the varied questions that have to be considered producing a photobook, the whole process from the image to the dummy and the finished book. Only a consequent image selection and an appropriate dramaturgy form the basis for a photobook that is above average. Marcus Shadden, Wolfgang Zebon, Nina Pop and Frederick Lesney represent a lively team that had a motivating influence on the previous workshop participants. How do you create a strong thread of photographs that is the backbone of each photobook? What is the right flow? How does a layout look like that emphasizes the effect of the photographs? From pamphlets to professionally produced books, a wide range of options exists within self-publishing, each of which is considered in this chapter. Referring to William E. Kessley's photobook Left London and Lebanon United the last summer as case studies. As with most creative practices, with self-publishing there are both incentives and deterrents, and really it is for the individual to determine which are the most important factors for their specific project, what their ambitions are and how those can best be realized in publishing their photobook. A rapidly growing phenomenon, there are currently approximately 50 photobook companies operating worldwide, each operating on a similar system. The user downloads a layout program from the photobook company, uploads and seeks sequences their photographs, adds captions if desired, selects the book size, cover material and cover, and then places an order. Typically, the finished photobook is returned to the customer within a week. Jerry Badger gave what is an interesting example of the market for photobooks. Speaking of an unsighted publisher who usually printed 1,000 copies but decided to print 10. 000 to reduce the unit cost although they had always sold out on a print run of 1000. They found that they still only sold 1000 and were left with 9000 to remainder and pull. Panel discussion, photography books and the future of publishing photography books. The spectrum of dummy formats is vast, and they do not necessarily involve high quality printing or painstaking planning. Whereas photographer Ralph Gibson outlines the care and attention he paid to his dummy for the somnambulist over a period of three years, continually adding, and, changing it, photographer Max Pam describes having produced a dummy on a 20-cent photocopy machine for his photobook going east that the publisher took completely as it was. Denise Wolf, commissioning editor of photography at Faden, believes that the market is more complex than this, however, and that there are two markets for the photobook. She distinguishes between photographic and artistic audiences and the general outbook buying audience. It is this kind of photobook I want to talk about, one that utilizes elliptical or nonlinear narrative, 
the kind of photo book in which poetry and mystery are the order of the day rather than clarity and the concrete. It could be argued, although I'm not going to do so here, that a history of photography through the photo book is a deal broader, more mainstream, more culturally and historically relevant than a history of photography through photographic art. Photographer Sil Labrat believes that aiming to be published in order to enhance a reputation is the wrong way to approach things, however, that it results more in a printed portfolio or album collection than in a photo book. Above all, lovers of photo books believe, and I am with them on this, that it is here where photography sings its loudest, and importantly, its deepest and most complex song, and there is one simple, but far reaching reason for this. The photo book can be regarded as an extension of the photo essay, a group of images brought together to make a picture story, the genre that came of age in the 1920s and 30s, and which defined a new profession, that of the photojournalist. The photo book, in short, is about narrative, making photographs tell a story, giving them relevant meaning. They are aged between 15 and 25, they spend a lot of time in front of computers, they seldom interact with others and live in their own world with various fantasies. Many are fans of these teenage models and willing to pay for a photo book that is of high quality, so that they can keep it in their collection. How would you evaluate if a certain photo book is a success? The best place to start thinking about your own photo book is to develop a knowledge base of features you like, appreciate and enjoy in the photo books made by others. Apart from visiting websites, the best ways of finding out about good photo book service providers is to ask friends, fellow photographers, photo store people and even your online Facebook connections. In addition, the term photo book typically defines a book created to fulfill a primarily artistic function, but is often applied to publications that are non-artistic in origin in order to increase the book's authority and value within the market. The photo book label is increasingly used to designate a book's aesthetic and market value to the exclusion of all other types of wealth. Photo book is a literal contraction of photographic book, which is often how the term is understood, however, its contemporary usage is more nebulous. While general surveys of the photo book present subjective selections within their pages, it is crucial that scholarship assesses and challenges current assumptions and categorizations of this kind. The Truthful Lens, a survey of the photographically illustrated book 18,441,914, 1980, is a precursor and useful counterpoint to many recent surveys that use the term photo book to indicate a certain level of visual artistry, exhibited through the images or layout, in photographic books. There is also no authoritative definition of the terms photo book or photographic book, a consensus has yet to be reached, and books will be classified and reclassified as this area develops. This vague, all-inclusive definition reinforces the concept that the photo book is directly linked to an artistic or creative mindset, conferring the status of out on the photographic literature to be auctioned, a useful sales tactic to appeal to an out-focused clientele. The term photo book is of relatively recent origin and is used to make a qualitative distinction from the majority of photographically illustrated books. With the advent of postmodernism in the 1970s and the movement's critiquing and deconstructing of modes of representation, the personal became the political anyway, so the personalizing of the photo book became accompanied by its own built in self critique, as in, for example, Sandy Sherman's untitled film Stills, 1990 which is at once about the fantastical representation of the self and the enormous power of media representation. This network breaks disciplinary boundaries by inviting academics and practitioners from a variety of disciplines to learn from and collaborate with one another, as in the photo books themselves, the whole is greater than the sum of its parts. Publish your photography book, co-authored by Darius D. Himes and Mary Vegina Swanson two of the Inficus self-published photo books jurors, offers a comprehensive and illustrated view of the publishing landscape, covering everything from marketing to the production process and is available through Amazon or at publishyorphotographybook.com. His main areas of research since 2009 include the history and historiography of the photo book, materiality and the photo book, and visual narrative under book form. His doctoral research is focused on the impact of the emergence of the artist's book upon photo book making since the 1960s.